Barrel out. There you go. So Spring Storm is uh, the Estonian uh, Defense Forces yearly training exercise. It's a brigade on brigade force exercise. We're generally one, one brigade. This year the second brigade plays a uh, enemy role or an op four role, and the first brigade plays that blue four friendly force role. And it's basically an exercise just to test the, uh, the strength of their military as well as uh, their ability to interoperate with NATO allied uh, forces. Getting to interoperate and uh, build those international alliances and those relationships has been a highly valuable experience for a lot of these soldiers, myself included. It's really good especially to get some of these younger soldiers being able to part partner with other nations that they may have not worked with before, give them a new experience. It's cool to actually hang out with different world soldiers. They take some of the things that we do and they're like, oh, that's, that's actually a good idea. You know, maybe we should start doing that. And then some of the things that we do are the same. For this exercise, I was the commander of the uh, joint force that came out here, and uh, all of our squads were integrated, Air Force, Army, and they're, they're true professionals. Took nine individuals from the Air Force side and integrated in with 35 from the Army. Uh, it was a very easy transition. Uh, we were broken down uh, by rank uh, underneath the Army leadership, so we had some squad leaders Air Force, we had fire team leaders in Air Force, and we also had airmen uh, performing in fire teams. So us being a military police unit, we were conducting operations such as convoy security, rear area security, detainee operations, uh, which would be our role in a uh, near peer conflict. So the detainee portion was a, a huge piece in this exercise. It was one of our, our bigger pieces that was evaluated. Uh, during that segment, we actually rolled to a site Right after we uh, accomplished setting it up, they rolled in five uh, enemy prisoners of war. Uh, we were on short timeline. Yeah. My team did not ask questions. Uh, they performed very well. We would like to integrate allies more into our own exercises, especially in cyberwise, because we also consider allies or allied forces as a part of our capability. So we've been working with the uh, Estonian Defense Force Cyber for the last 10 years. Uh, so the relationship has evolved and we uh, are actually live on the network. So this is a first for us. It's a big deal because we have different laws and, and different regulations that normally prevent us from being on different partner nation networks. So this is huge for us that they actually trust us enough to let us on and, and look at the real data that's across the network. We look at stuff certain way. We have a certain understanding. Having an extra eyes from different countries, so at the moment from France and then US, so having those extra pair of eyes that have different experience gives us uh, more insight into what's going on. Well, stateside training, it's kind of like repetition. You pretty much know what you're doing, where you're going. It's kind of like the same thing. And then when you're going like overseas here, it's kind of Okay, I'm somewhere else, don't know what we're doing, don't know where I'm at, don't know the language. So it's, it's interesting, it's fun, and you know, it makes for great stories when you go back home and everybody's like, oh, how was your annual training? You're like, I did this, and I did this, and I learned this, I met these cool people. I love what I do.